Hello guys, welcome back to um, Levi's Aviation. Today we're going to be building the BMP2 tank. Um, in you know BMP2 tank, which Russia are using against uh, Ukraine. So to build this, you will need dark prismarine stairs, dark prismarine slabs, warp trap door, green carpet, polished deep slate slab, polished deep slate stairs, green terracotta dark oak trap door and black handles to start off this build you're going to start off with by placing so this is quite awkward you're going to place five upside down polished deep slate stairs three four five so that's five two four five yeah that's right that's five after the, well basically wait these don't like that uh, no you don't don't do that cancel that uh, cancel we're going to go do a polished deep slate slab to do this place terracotta place green terracotta and place a polished deep slate slab on the top half of the terracotta break it when you break it you're going to place five polished deep slate stairs two three four five After that, you're going to place, you're going to do this pattern on both sides. See ya, and wait, wait, wait. After that, place a, another polished thing. After that, you're going to place one, two, three, four, five. You're going to place five of them, two going backwards. You're going to copy that. And the other side, you're going to place one, two, three, four, Five, five polished deep slate stairs, and two facing backwards. This is just so you can get like the treads, like the treads of the aircraft. Um, so you've got the treads, which so starting that looks pretty decent to be honest. It's better than I could play actually. I don't think you have that. No, you don't think you do. But anyway, we'll just break that. I don't know. You will see how I've been a bit. So, when you get here on this polished deep slate stair, what you will need to do is place. Make sure you can place. To put a tries a slab like that on both sides. Then. Yeah, I've definitely done this wrong. So you go do this like this. You go do two. Four, five, two, four, five, six, seven. Boop. Then we're gonna get you're gonna get warp trap door. Place. Cross. You need to crouch. Press crouch. This might work for you. I don't know. And you're also gonna place warp trap doors here. So that so it should be coming in should be coming in something like that. It's probably not in the centre but the best I can do. That's what you should be looking like. Then you need to add dark oak trap doors, I think, behind that, I think. I don't know. I'm just gonna check off my um, paper sheet. I'll be back in a minute folks. Just looking at my planning sheet, it'll be two minutes, guys. So we're just going to... 
just for people who thought this is wrong, I think I've done it wrong on a piece of paper. I think it should be one more block in. So just delete. If you've copied this bit, guys, I'm so sorry. It's my first time doing this. This is wrong. This is the um, other time. This is the BMP6. I thought I was doing the 6, not the 2. Uh, start from here. So, uh, terracotta. Dot polished deep slate slab. Then after that, you are going to place five blocks along polish deep slate stairs. So what you're going to do now, you're going to do one, two, three, four, five. You're going to place five of that. And then you're going to add two facing backwards. Place polished deep slate slab, two going up top. So what you should look like is that. Then after that, you should have three trap doors. You should have. Wait a minute, this is a bit wrong in it. Wait, wait a minute. You should have. Place one. Yeah. Here. And you're gonna place three <laughs> dark oak trap doors. <laughs> this side you're gonna place two here. Yeah. With dark oak trap doors going across three times. So you should be looking at something like this. Then what you're gonna do is you are going to place dark oak trap doors where you've got warp trapped so it should look similar to this so you have like a weird shape that's how it should be looking so far then after that you're going to place a dark prismarine slabs so get your dark prismarine slabs you're going to do two by two going across and that's simple and the reason why I've cut this off is because of a little trick. Because here, in a minute, um, so here, so once you have done that, we've got four, two sets of. <laughs> I can't believe. Basically, put. Okay, I think I've messed this tutorial up, guys. I'm so sorry. Okay, what we're gonna do is do that. When you've done that, you can like work like backwards, really. You can do two here, bam, bam, like this. And then you can go one, two, that's three, four, five, one, two. And then. That. So if I should be looking like this, it's coming along. Don't worry. Then you should have the dot prismarine slabs. Don't forget them. We need to fill in, fill in the entirety of this with dot prismarine slabs. I'm looking at my sheet. Yep, dot prismarine slabs. You should be looking at this. Nice. Once you've done that. You will need a green terracotta to place along this set of this. You've got to place five green terracotta coming along. Two, three, four, five. Um, after that, guys, you will use um, more green terracotta. So you are going to be doing this pattern. You need to make sure you do this pattern on both sides. If you don't do it on both sides, you've messed it up. You're going to do one here, place three, one. You're going to copy this pattern along. Then you're going to place stuff like that. Should be looking something similar to this. 
if you've got that, you are doing good so far, guys. After that, once you've done that, you are going to be using a special technique that probably not many of you know how to do. So just be careful because I am going to be pretty quick. But we'll not we'll do that later on. To start, we're going to place dark prismarine slabs across the um like the back of the BMP2. You're gonna come over here where you've got these five green terracotta coming along. You're gonna place five dark prismarine stairs. Just to make sure we've got like a bit of a flow onto it. Then you are going to get your black candle. You're going to place three black candles on each of the first and the fifth block. Make sure you've placed three. Three black candles on the fifth and first block of the dark prismarine stairs. After that, you will use um, warped trap doors. You're going to be using warped trap doors to place where... There are no black candles. Basically, placing them back in the middle, the uh, the middle three. So you're gonna do something similar to this. After that, you are gonna place a green carpet either side. So green, green here. So you should be looking at that. Green carpet on both sides. If you don't make sure it's not lime. It needs to be green because military stuff are green. So that's that. After you are going to place dark five or like a row of dark prismarine slabs. So what you're going to do is you're going to place them like this. Make sure they like come out. So make sure there's something like this. Um, just to make sure you can do the track or the treads. So now we're going to be doing the treads of the BMP2. We're going to place some uh, a dark prismarine slab. We're going to go across the entirety of the treads um, all the way until you touch the deep slate. Um, and then you're going to do that on the opposite side as well. Then you're going to place a deep slate brick wall. So you need to go into your in, um, inventory menu. We're going to go go to uh, construction click on walls and you are going to go across to get deep slip brick wall which is at the end of the walls once you've got that you can go click LT if you want control if you've got PS4 Nintendo it's probably going to be different for you but if you want control of SLT and um, you should be able to go into this menu. When you're on this menu, you're going to remove your black candle. You'll not need your black candle anymore. Once you have done that, you're going to place brick walls where there's gaps. So you can see where the gaps are. You're going to place brick walls here. Once you've done that, you should have four, two on either side. After that, we're going to place at the back, or well at the front, we're going to place a row of three prismarine, dark prismarine stairs. So you're going to have one, two, three. Once you've done that, you are getting there. After that, you're going to place slabs. So you're going to do three here and extend out like this. Well done. After that, you'll need to go into the um, inventory menu. You're going to get rid of your deep slate brick walls. You're going to go to. Um, you're going to go to. Let me find it. You're going to go to items. Go down to signs. And you need to make sure it's a warped sign. Once you've got a warped sign, don't text anything. You're just going to be putting warp signs literally here and also while you're here you can put warp signs on the corners to make it a bit more realistic so you should have something like this this is the um this is the back 
this is the back of the um build i think this, yeah this is the back so that's what it should look like after once you've done that make sure you do get the two corners in if you forget it you can do it on later because it's not really going to affect anything after that you're going to get a warped slab so you're going to move your warped sign go into construction go to slabs and you're going to find the warped slab once you've got the warped slab you are going to go um you're going to go here place warp slab here and here and then in between you're going to place dark prismarine slabs just in between them you're going to place dark prismarine slabs like that you're going to place to extend so you're going to extend it by one it should be looking like that that extend like when i mean extend you're going to go forward by one dark prismarine slab once you've then done that, you are going to place two dark prismarine slabs in this. You're going to miss a slab, so miss this block here. You're going to miss that block. You're going to place two, miss, place two. should be identical to each other. If they're not, you've done it wrong. After that, you are going to place, two. you're going to basically destroy this slab. You're going to destroy that slab destroy it then you're going to place warped slab next to each other should come like this and then what you want to do is you want to get a deep slate two polished deep slate slabs which you do have already you're going to place um going to destroy this you're going to place Oh wait, not place two. I've already placed. Wait, is one done two? Oh, don't I know opposite. Okay, I, I see what's happened. I see what's happened. Sorry, wrong side. You've got to look where's the front. The front is on this side. You're going to place two polished deep slate slabs. Then you're going to go into your inventory, get rid of the green carpet, and you're going to trade it for um, a polished black stone slab you need to get a polished black stone slab it, it has to be brick don't just get a black stone one it's got to be brick once you've got that you place that at the end so that's doing good once you have done that you're going to place a mossy or cobbled deep slate wall so you're going to get removed the black stone um polished whatever slab you had you're going to get a cobbled deep slate wall, which is here. You're going to place the cobbled deep slate wall in two, well, one position for now. You're going to place it here. Then you're going to place a forward deep slate dark prism moon stair, like that. And then you are going to place yet another um pol dark prismarine slab once you've done that you are going to place green terracotta behind once you've done that you're going to just do a two by three so you're going to do two here another two and another two then after that you're going to go back by one then you're going to remove the cobble deep slate wall and you're going to get a mossy cobblestone wall so you're going to get that you're going to put that up here and here then what you're going to want to do is you want to get a dark prismarine stair place that there and then you're going to get dark prismarine slabs and what you're going to do is you're going to look like a t like a letter t but just a little bit weird of looking um, after that, you are going to get a zombie head. So remove the mossy cobblestone wall. You're going to go to items. Go down to mob skulls. And you're going to get a zombie and a wither. The wither, the wither skeleton skull 
it's going to be for later but get the zombie one for now we're going to place it facing these corners so it's not showing the face if it does show the face you've done it wrong then you're going to place another zombie zo zombie head this way after that you're going to place three iron bars so you're going to go to items scroll down i think it's on items come on come on come on come on come on no it's not there apparently uh where is it 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 um you're gonna get here on construction you're gonna go up by three like that then once you have get once you've done that you're gonna get a dark oak. You're gonna get a dark oak fence gate. So you're going to fence gate. Make sure it's a dark oak. And you are gonna place that on the side where you've got these three tall iron bars. You can place that there. Then you're gonna get a wither skeleton skull, which you should have in your inventory already. Um, then you're gonna place that there. Doing good. After that, you are going to. So make sure the skeleton skull standing up. Like you've got to make sure it's like. I can't make it sure, but you just place it on top, okay? Just place it wherever you want on this wall because you can't get it up like that. It's only if you have a different version. Then you want to want to get is you want to get back your warp sign. We moved that for the wither skeleton skull. You're going to place warp signs on this bit and this bit. Make sure there's no text. Um, then after that, guys, you are going to do your final, well, slowly get into your final. So you're going to do the Z marking. The Z marking, you will need to go to slabs. You're going to get a polished diorite slab. You're going to remove... You are basically going to remove this corner one. You're going to place that there. Then you're going to go across. Do the same thing on each side. So once you have done that, you have almost, pretty much almost done. After that, you will get a, um, a, like, one of these sensor things. I don't know what they're called. You're going to go to items and scroll down for the daylight sensor. The daylight sensor you're going to place on the stair like that. Then you're going to place, for make sure it's day, you're going to crouch and place three um, dark oak trap doors going forward. And after that, you are going to go to do your final bit. You're going to get a birch fence gate. And you're going to go onto the back and place it there like that. Once you've done that, you have completed the BMP2. So it may have been a long tutorial, but you have completed the BMP2. This is what it should look like after 100% fully completed. If you want to make any changes, you, can, you are welcome to do so. But please make sure... You don't mess with this because if you do mess with some bits, you will it will not look as how it looks on the screen. So I would suggest leaving it like this. Thank you for watching the tutorial. Hopefully you subscribed, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.